Hello and welcome, and I can tell you it was a dry walk to the gantry today, no rain in sight. My name's Derek Ray, and delighted to have alongside me, as usual on these occasions, Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere really building up nicely, we should be in for a terrific contest. It is Augsburg against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. Textbook defending inside the box. And clears the danger. Moving it forward. Lionel Messi. Here's Mbappe. Well, as you can see, that's a great bit of skill. He times this so sweetly. What a good goal that is. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1-0. Salem Aldosseri. Enzo Fernandez. And reading it absolutely superbly. Deflected behind, corner forthcoming. Struggling to get it away. Well, it came to nothing in the end. He's in with a chance. Well, the header at least made the goalkeeper think. Enzo Fernandez. Lionel Messi. He's in here. Oh, excellent timing stop. And not giving the opposition much of a look in. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box. Just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really goal good goal. For Paris so underway again, and a 2-0 advantage 20, here. Yosko, now the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. So the second half is underway, and really it was a dizzying performance from Paris Saint-Germain in the first 45. Veron, Bellingham, Mbappe, a wonderful intervention. Bruno Fernandes, Bruno Fernandes has it. Salem al Dosseri and a timely intervention chance to do damage keeper getting the touch well they can keep possession now well we have 20 minutes left in this game can he finish Oh, marvellous defending to deny him. And given the defender's touch, the referee says corner. And they will make the change now. No keeper will mind that sort of corner. 
Well, as we approach full time, Paris Saint-Germain absolutely coasting to victory, Stuart. Well, I think the scoreline reflects the difference between the two teams. For most of the game, they've dictated the play and they've created some really good chances. I think it's been an excellent performance. Now, options are plenty. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Went in strongly to win the ball. And there's the final whistle, and we can confirm a victory for Paris Saint-Germain. What did you think of their overall display? Well, fairly comfortable at the end, wasn't it? But they controlled the middle of the pipe well. Going forward, there was some really nice incisive play too. It's a good result for them.